So, as we all know, Insomniac games have been very quiet over the last few years about Wolverine. And we are kind of just wondering when the hell we are actually going to get a update. Well, I might have good news for you guys. Ladies and gentlemen, we might get finally an update on Wolverine. Thank you, Insomniac Games. So this is all coming from a new rumor that we are going to discuss in today's video. So sit back, relax, enjoy, take a beverage and let's get on with this news. So we're going to talk about a rumor from Kurakasis and I have featured him in multiple videos in the past and he is pretty reliable he isn't though your normal insider leaker kind of person shall i say in the industry he sees himself more as a video game researcher whatever the hell that's supposed to mean but he has been correct on a lot of stuff and i think he just digs on a lot of websites and backends stuff like that to find out information and we're going to cover that in today's video by the way if you have a good comment of your own it can be a about anything it can be about playstation are you guys still excited for wolverine let me know in the comment section down below now let's take a look at this tweet from kurakasis from my little digging it looks like sony is gearing up to show off some new stuff from marvel's wolverine it's hard for me to determine when it will happen but i'm guessing it will be this year either at the game awards or at some unannounced super secret event now that is pretty interesting that he's still saying this year because we had the insomniac leaks not too long ago and they were pretty devastating for insomniac in general and we got a whole pipeline of games they are working on right now one is a new ratchet and clank game that is very very far away another one is the venom game and i was really thinking we would see the venom game first because they have all the assets already for playing as venom so i was thinking we would get the venom game first but apparently maybe not or maybe we'll still get the venom game first but they kind of just want to update us on wolverine i don't know it's pretty weird but yeah in that leak there was also said that wolverine would be delayed until 2026 so i find it kind of weird that they are showing wolverine already off this year if it is in fact a 2026 game so the thing is playstation has changed their marketing style with very short announcement to release shall i say windows where they announce a game look at ghost of yote ghost of yote is the most recent example of this basically and ghost of yote is already ready next year so they have one year of marketing time ish shall i say maybe even shorter than that depending on when ghost of yote is coming out it might be a summer release now this might also be something because of the playstation 5 pro and i've said this in previous videos how playstation needs to show us the future why we should buy a playstation 5 pro because what games are going to make use of the playstation 5 pro and you can't just come with old games only saying yeah final fantasy 7 rebirth is now running at 60 fps uh hooray that is absolutely amazing news i mean this can be done in a blog post but not a lot of people will care about this when you have actually new games to show off first party stuff like a ghost of yote and maybe an update towards wolverine that would incentivize people to buy that PlayStation 5 Pro. So that's why I think we are going to get to see Wolverine a little bit earlier. Now at the end of this year. When could this happen? Well, in the comment section on X they are discussing about this. And apparently there is in New York supposed to be like a Marvel event today. I don't hope it's today because then this video is basically going to be ruined but or it could be in fact indeed at the game awards and the game awards would be a pretty good spot to show off wolverine insomniac games have been nominated and 
maybe I, I don't know if they actually won ever something at the game awards themselves uh, i don't actually know that but they have been always nominated for game of the year stuff so that is a good place for them to show off wolverine if they have some sort of a update for that i think that is a good one to show off uh, let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think of this rumor do you guys think we will in fact see wolverine soon let me know in the comment section down below. Now, I also wanted to do some updates. The Pokemon leaks are happening right now. And I was thinking of making a video on it. But the thing is, it is so oversaturated with these videos for the Pokemon leaks. And a lot of colleagues of mine already made videos very fast on it. And I was like, I'm going to get too much competition with this. And my video won't do well at all. So I was like, I'm just not going to do the Pokemon leaks at all. And a lot of stuff is old information anyway like for older games beta pokemons stuff like that and that's very cool but my audience really cares about new games stuff like that so i thought yeah not really worth it to make a video on and i have been very busy playing metaphor right now it is a absolutely amazing game that's also the reason why i haven't made any videos over the last week <laughs> i'm sorry about that it's because of metaphor and also silent hill 2 i'm so busy right now with a lot of stuff not just gaming but also other stuff right now i also made a second channel as kind of a experiment i want first want to see how it's going to do uh, numbers wise and then i might put more attention to it by the way, there's nothing going to happen with this channel. This channel is just going to stay in upload. So you don't need to leave. Uh, just enjoy the content that's coming your way. And I will be doing more gaming leaks and rumors stuff on this channel. I might change up the content a bit that I will basically bring the review stuff over to the other channel. But I'm not sure of that yet. It's just an experiment for now to see how it's going to work out. But... I will let you guys know if that will be something actually tangible for the near future. Uh, I'm not going to do a comment of the day for this video. Simply really because I didn't receive any comments in my last video. So yeah, I, I can't really do a comment of the day if there are no comments. So make sure to comment in the comment section down below and i might feature your comment in the next video thank you guys for watching as always like this video if you like it subscribe to the channel if you want to see more gaming news leaks rumors to watch the biggest single player games that's what i usually do uh thank you guys for watching as always and i will see you guys in the next video bye bye and tot out